princesses. Today I'm going to be talking about the Etude House Etouinette Crystal Brush Collection and the Rose Brush. All of these brushes are limited edition but you can find the Crystal Brush Collection in a lot of shops online and you can find the Rose Brush online but it is quite expensive. The product description of the Etouinette Crystal Brush Set Collection says The Etude House Etouinette Crystal Brush Collection is a collection of three kinds of brushes made from all natural goat hair. The brush collection comes in a pink pastel lace pouch. The three brushes are Lip Gradiation Tip, Soft Touch Powder Brush and Last Touch Fan Brush. These brushes ensure that you will have a perfect kind and quality of makeup that you need for any look. The brush collection comes housed in this gorgeous pink lace brush holder. Sadly, this brush holder is only fit to house these three blushes as they are quite short and the lip brush is super skinny. But it is gorgeous nonetheless. The Soft Touch Powder Brush Pick up a certain amount of powder on brush and sweep across face in a soft circular motion to express satin covered luxurious skin. This is just your regular fluffy powder brush. It's great for powders or blush or bronzers and it applies easy albeit a little scratchily. These brushes are made from goat hair so they do tend to frizz a little and they also smell like goats which does fade a little with time and washing but it smells really awful when they're first being washed. The Last Touch Fan Brush Sweep across face after completing all makeup. Cleans up unnecessary powder particles for a finer and smoother complexion. I've never needed to use this brush to clean up my face before because I don't really use loose pigments or anything like that, but it does work really well as a highlighter brush. Lip Gradiation Brush Apply a certain amount of lipstick onto brush and dab brush on inner lip area for rosy lips. This is such a weird brush for me and it's definitely not something I would go out of my way to purchase separately. The tip is some sort of soft foam and it's quite flexible when blending lip colours into the lip. However, it tends to just push the lip colour around rather than blending it into the lip. It does work but it's really tedious and I'd much rather just use my fingers. Rose brush. This rose brush is absolutely gorgeous, but in reality it's not really so practical. The rose shaped bristles look great, but Etude House claims that they will help hug the contours of the face, but I find that they make applications look a little bit patchy. I do quite like it as a kabuki brush for face powders, though it's not something that I reach for regularly. I think that this one's more like eye candy for me. Though these brushes are gorgeous, I don't really think that the rose brush is worth the money that it's currently being sold for since it's very limited edition. The crystal brush set is being sold at a reasonable price in a lot of K-beauty stores and I think it would be a great grab if you like really pretty princessy things. There's no denying that these brushes are really cute, but there's also no denying that they all smell like goats. They are also a little scratchy in comparison to synthetic fibre brushes. I really love that these brushes have really gorgeous packaging and that most of the brushes work for their intended purpose. I do not love that these brushes smell like goat or when they're being washed they smell like wet goat. The rose brush applies powder really patchily and the lip gradation brush is just a little bit weird for me. I'll definitely keep mine since they are limited edition but do weigh up the pros and cons of these brushes before making a purchase that is more expensive than you might want. I would definitely recommend grabbing these brushes if you're really into cute princessy things or you want to complete the collection of the Etouinette brushes but otherwise just think a little bit about them because they are quite scratchy to use and they do smell really weird and some of the brushes are not really that useful in all honesty. Thank you so much for watching this review and I'll see you next time. Bye! Hello princesses! Today I'm going to be talking about the Etude House Etouinette Crystal Brush Collection and the Rose Blush.